What is going on everybody? How are you guys doing? Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to Collecting Havoc. You guys know I'm John. I'm the host of the shenanigans and uh, we're going to go on a toy hunt. Today's goal, find something new. Yeah, I just want something new. I'm kind of tired of the clearance finds, although I will always look for clearance finds because you never know what you find. But I'd like to find something new, something that I have not seen yet. Uh, so we'll be looking for that. Um, I know there's not a lot supposed to be hitting this week. A lot of stuff is uh, scheduled for next weekend, even into Monday, Tuesday. So maybe we'll get lucky and somebody stocks it early. Never know. But anyways, this is a busy weekend for me. Um, my grandma's 91st birthday, so that will be taking up some of my time. Uh, Got to do some other life stuff, but I will take all the free time I get and I will toy hunt and hopefully we find some goodies. Anyways, you guys, let's go look at some toys. All right, what do we got going on in Botland? We got a lot of Toxitron left. No clearance tags, though, here. So I know people have been saying clearance has been all over the place. And then, who? Terrence Ben Gar. Oh, that's one of these. It's got to be these things, I think. But check this out. Thundertron from the Prime Universe. I've never seen this guy before. At least I don't think I have. Have I? Oh, that's cool. All right. Not bad, not bad. Headless uh, Leo Prime. And then, of course, tons of these. Tons. Oh, what else we got? Oh, we got the new scrap heap. All right. So it's a little bit of new. Not much, but it's it's a start. It's a start. Because we did see one new figure we haven't seen yet. So that's as far as I can remember. I'm getting old. My memory's shot. So. Uh, these are on clearance somewhere I saw. I have to look. can't remember where I saw those on clearance. Same with those. And I know a couple people in their videos have seen those on clearance. As much as I dislike this, the Mutant Mayhem stuff, the, the In Disguise one actually doesn't look that bad. So... We'll see. Uh, Kevin Spacey. Lots of Kevin Spacey. And then poor, poor MJ. Oh, we got a restock of the Infinity Wave. What's left of it? Got a Bruce, Cap, Iron Man, and Thor. And then just these old guys that have been here forever. Nothing exciting here. All right. I mean, unless you're looking for them, I guess it would be exciting then if you're actually missing them. Oh, there's a flash up there. Which flash is that? Oh, check that out. Oh, all right. Finally, this is the first time I think I've seen this guy. So, that's pretty cool. I'm going to assume he goes here somewhere. DC Gold. Oh, that's Robin, but whatever. Check that out. Somebody's trying to hide him. I mean, it was a pretty bad hiding spot, but that's pretty cool. That's really... Is that the, is that a comic one? It looks pretty good. Could it be good for uh, building your original Justice League? Or, not original Justice League, but the modern one. Oh, look it, there's another one. Huh, check that out. So, not bad, not bad. So, we got we got the start of a pretty decent hunt. We found a new Transformer, some new DC figs. Um, what else can we find? Nothing down here. Oh, we got Undertaker and Roman. But that's about it for there. Power Rangers down to 13 bucks. Ooh. It says $17.50. I'm going to scan it. If I can get my the app to work, I might scan him. I, as much as I do like the uh, Power Ranger... Uh, bad guys, the creatures, they're fun. They fit into a lot of different places. I might I might check this out. But right now he's... The peg's saying Red Ranger, though. So it's always tough to tell what they mean on some of these. Because look here. I got another Red Ranger. Same thing as 1750. So who knows. But no, no clearance tags here. These are all regular places. But Lando... Let, oh wait! Oh, this is on the. I know this is on the website for under ten bucks. I was looking last night. Then look at our buddy Lando. More of the Ahsoka wave. Got a Mandalorian Death Watch. Uh, yeah. 
Yeah, same guys as always. Somebody said they found this guy for two bucks somewhere. That would be awesome if I could do that. And then more Landos. Han. If you need Han for your 375s. I don't know if that's just a one-off and he's left over, but I'm not 100% sure on the TBC uh, distribution. And that looks like just the normal uh, WWE figures, 105, older basics. Superstars don't look like they're anything special. None of the new stuff. It's all older stuff we've seen for a few months. No Captain Lou Albano. Uh, although that his WWE Elite Legend 22 wave is starting to hit target, I've heard, but I don't think I'll find it in my area because Captain Lou Albano for me is a must. Uh, $8 for Naked Stratus wave. And then we got $9 on Destro, but this is all. I'm sure they'd price match her, but yeah, we got Lady J's for days and days and days. And anything over here? Nothing new. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh, it's like, I was hoping we could see some of the new uh, video game characters people have been seeing now. Was it Streets of Rage and uh, um, Altered Beast? So it'd be cool, but no, not yet. I'm not lucky enough to find those yet. But that's about it. Let's uh, look. I'm going to go check out Clearance Aisle if there's anything there, and then uh, their NECA section. All right, so this is the first place I found this end cap, and it hasn't moved at all. All right, what do we got coming on? the aisle here uh, 17 bucks for that one i think these are all the same ones we've been seeing so mm, care bears over here brats more brats rainbow sh shadow high i don't know is there a difference so i don't know I'm assuming they're like some rival schools. I don't know. And then, yeah, there's more over here. Not a whole lot of uh, uh, Monster High here. I wonder if they cleared them out for clearance. I'll have to look in the clearance aisle. But yeah, I'm not seeing a whole lot of Monster High stuff. Usually there's a whole section. All they got is that up there. All right, so let me go check. Hopefully, um, you guys are seeing what you like, and uh, I'll move on. What do we got here? Just random stuff. Fragili. Uh, see, I want these to be lower. At least they're nine bucks here. But with the taxes, it just might as well just pay ten bucks in Wisconsin. <laughs> uh, so what is going on with their clearance? It's like, okay, I think some of their stuff is still on clearance here. Okay, so I still see clearance tags because I know in at my home store everything went crazy like some stuff went off clearance some stuff went back. it's just weird so look he's off clearance now again so i don't know what is going on they have the bride of frankenstein bon scott she's still 15 bucks willow's 10 and i still think that's too much <laughs> five bucks i'll bite but it's the same stuff here that we've been seeing everywhere else broadway some of these and they're all so the only thing that went down to 20 bucks still is uh casey jones dream War. Ooh, that is the dream oh no it's freddy's revenge ah uh, that's not the dream warrior Toonie terrors Toonie terrors so huh interesting but yeah it looks like broadway is no longer on clearance brooklyn maybe but yeah all right, Bride of Frankenstein, Predator 2, uh, Hooper, Dark Redeemer, Nightmare Spawn. All right, Majin Buu. Okay, I definitely am going to see what else I can find because I don't know what happened to their clearance. It's like everything was on clearance, and then everything that was on clearance is not on clearance. I don't know if anybody knows what the heck's going on. Let me know. Seriously. Becky, Predator, Casey's 35 here. Krang's 45. Oh, he's 10 bucks for Jay Garrick. Bumblebee 72. All right. 3.99. Oh, that's a Hot Wheel. They got that in the wrong spot. Okay. <laughs> I was gonna say. Oh, and look at all the Lorcana. 
All right, I gotta go find. I gotta go find what I came here for. Okay, what do we got over here? Bam. Yeah, that's a good taker. Oh yeah, glare. And then the former, former champion. Uh, Hot Wheels, Barbies, Hangover. Uh, somebody finally figured out the uh, platinum was here. Assassin's Creed. Turns out I didn't. I forgot this was uh, this two pack was a Best Buy exclusive. I forgot about that. That's why I was wondering why I hadn't seen that anywhere else. Uh, National Treasure, Elvira. Oh, seen both of them together. That's kind of cool. Got the footbot. Is this the white one or the blue one? Or that one? Okay. Oh, that's right. That's the Sinja Patrol. That's right. The white and the blue. Wander. Raphael. Ooh, that looks good. It looks good. Too bad I'm out on this. I just, I can't do Ronin. Yep, not going to try to pronounce your name because I suck at it. <laughs> Anime heroes, and then they actually have some SH figures here. All right. Uh, I still haven't found what I was looking for yet. I'll have to go over there and get it. None of this is on sale or clearance, so full price, no clearances, no crazy sales. Legos, Legos, and more Legos. If th there's more Legos, there's more stuff over there. Oh, there's a helmet. That's an old black. Is it old? Oh, is that old Luke Skywalker? Do they still have the red band? Huh, I don't remember. But all right, I'm gonna go see what else is here because we got all kinds of stuff. Plushies, Squishmallows, Squishmallows. Pokemon cards, more Lorcana, more Lego. All right, time to go find what I'm looking for because that's it. Always gotta start over here because never know. That's fun. All right, abomination. But yeah, there's nothing else over here. Let's go look in the back. Hmm, speeder bikes. What do we got going on over here? Oh, the prana plant made it here for six bucks. Ooh, tempting. Oh, that Donald Duck is here. Blue, Mickey Bell. Oh, and they got the fractured version. That's a lot of purple. <laughs> well, Renegade Shadow. That's actually a pretty cool figure for a three and three quarter. They made some good figures for Fortnite, but too bad the line didn't carry on from Hasbro because I think they, I don't know if they canceled it or just put it on pause. But anyways, here's the U U Hacka Show from Abby Style Studios. Uh, if you are a fan of Art G, he opened up the Ichigo statue on his last live stream, and the thing is gonna be mine if I can ever find it. But we got a Cat Mario. Hmm? Uh, no, there's something over here. We got an Atom Smasher. We got some statues. We got a, uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh oh, we got a chase. Oh, ho, ho, ho. look at that. Oh, ho, ho. that is awesome. And it's $12.99. Oh, there's like six of them here. Wow. All right. No, are there any of them chases? Just the one. Oh, that box is coming apart. But that is awesome. That's a chase. I think that is coming home with me. Don't know what I'll do with it, but he's coming home with me. <laughs> and then there's just all this stuff. There's another Fortnite down there. And just a few odds and ends. Yeah, just the same stuff we, we've been seeing. Bratz, Matchamals, Barbie. All right, I'm gonna get my prize and, hmm, what will we find today? I know I keep saying it every couple videos, but these are pretty cool if they did them in more properties than just Pokemon. I'd like to see a few other ones. Um, hmm. Wow. No legends that I can see so far. Nothing hidden. No, nope, no legends. 
No, we got yep, mutton junkyard and uh, he's everywhere. Oh, check it out. So they're starting to hang out here and there a little bit. Um, Copperhead's on clearance. Viper is not listed, but I know she's on hidden clearance in some stores. We already saw that. That's an old two-pack. Old, old, old. Animal Man's 13 bucks. Here we got a bat fleck. Looks like they got some of the newer Transformers. We got the Wheeljack. Hey, check it out. He's out of place, but... First time I believe I've seen him outside of Best Buy. Nope, I've seen him at Target before. Never mind. Transformers toys are 20% off. Ooh. Ooh. All right, but of course... Oh, Page Punchers. One of them is 15% off. So, but there's no... Of course, no Transformers that I really want, so it could be 20% off all day, but need to have something I want. But at least there is stuff. These are the Starscream is pretty cool. This Gamer Edition. Got Megatron, which really based on that should be Galvatron, based on that look. His name should actually be probably Galvatron. Unless there's a story reason for it in a comic that I don't know about. <laughs> Alright. <clears throat> I've been in this aisle long enough. Let's see what else we can find. It is empty. There is no wrestling at the end. It is wiped out. Dinosaurs. Turtles. Playset. Mondo Gecko. Mm, is that Bebop? Ray Filet. Wing nut and screw loose I already have. Oh, we got go car weathers. We got <laughs> more Lando. She's still here. Oh, you're out of place, buddy. So they have two out of three, of course. Oh, sweet. Got a couple of those guys. And uh <laughs> that is it. Look at that. And they're either doing a reset or somebody don't know how to stock. I don't know. But of course. Oh, nope, I was wrong. No land no no Andra. Wow. We got some mutatins. Oh, okay. okay. Let's see which one is in Donnie. And Raphael. Alright guys, I'm gonna go find clearance in NECA and see what else is going on here. We got a clearance rainbow hide trunk. Beast Wars. That's probably just over here because somebody's being lazy. Build drum concrete. Lots of those. And I know there's another end cap of collectibles. All these are on clearance. 15 bucks. Thrawn for nine. Oh, that's not much of a clearance. Mm, what else we got? We got the Bat Cycle, 15 bucks. Raz al Ghul from the Solomon Grundy way, the Grundy Wear Wave. But that's it over here. At least on the end cap, a couple dinosaurs, some a botany set, another Bat Cycle, and nothing hidden around. So, but not too bad. Let's go over to NECA. All right, guys, what's going on? We got. Oh, these look a little different. Maybe? Or at least it's a bigger selection. That's what it is. It's probably just a bigger selection. But here you go, ladies. Girl dads. Stuff that you guys can get the little girls into. Lady collectors. You know, some of you guys. Bronies, whatever. <laughs> Anyways. It's a pretty decent selection, it looks like. Some of these I don't recognize, so they might be new. Uh, and then uh, friends Legos, but we'll we'll do the Legos on our Thursday video. Uh, maybe I'll throw in some of the friends too on there. But no sale, no clearance. So this is the morning of Sunday. So you guys will probably see this today. Bratz dolls down there. Um, Barbie stuff, Squishmallows, plushies. So. Oh, this is that uh, Our Generation stuff. That's what this is. All right, guys. I'm going to go. All right. Well, we got 
that end cap and then it turned so we've been seeing this a lot but check it out lando and ripped car weathers another lando purred purred yeah. heard it first i'm purred final word blah, 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 final word of purred and then that's all that we got the is that 25th anniversary of episode one? Oh man it's been 25 years already jeez all right, found their NECA Holothon end cap, and it is a bunch of old stuff until you see this. This new Gundam is pretty cool, and it's a Target exclusive, so huh, not bad. But yeah, there's nothing here. This is all old stock that they moved from the regular section. So, and I don't see any end caps looking around, so now we'll go find NECA. All right, what do we got going on here? Uh, one piece statue cards mostly sports cards ever sue check it out <clears throat> I've been hearing these been on clearance I'm gonna check this out if they're 1250 or less I might actually take this one home it's got some good soft goods on it so okay he's vibrating that's interesting Tony Terrors, Janata, uh, Hunter X Hunter statue, old uh, old Mecca stock, old Batman stock. Mm, yeah, all right. Glow in the dark, mummy ash. Uh, Tony Terrors, the American Werewolf of London version, different Frankenstein's monster. Classes of the Swamp. We not screw loose. Demona's back there. Old Skeletor. <coughs> Two pack. <laughs> Herbert West. Oh, that's cool. From the Reanimator. Genghis Frog. We got a uh, Captain Kirk back there. <laughs> Condo out of place. So definitely the only one from this case then that's moved is Scarlet. Because if I remember right, you get. Two Rakondos, two Dukes, and a Scarlet. And then Pops down there. I'm not seeing anything out of the ordinary. Oh, they got one new Batman. And then the rest is just random, shouldn't be back here stuff. <laughs> All right, I'm going to move on. Um, what? I came down to film, but this is just sitting here. What? No way. Doesn't look like anything's wrong with it. Oh, this is absolutely a freaking insane find. Ho ho. Ho ho. And literally, I was just going to grab her because she was on clearance for 1250. That's awesome. That is awesome. All right, guys. We'll come back over in a little another section, but check it out. We got Eagle Talon Fighter. Ma! Zaymont's still here, but should be five bucks, but there's no tag, so he'll sit here forever. Plus, it's pretty beat up. Mm. All right, we got that going on. Uh, statues. Magic Mickey. Statues. Sega statues looking all right. Um, more statues. Statues. Uh, looks to be about it. I'm gonna go flip around and finish where I was looking at the other side to see if there's anything. How you doing? doing all right, man. All right, what else we got going on here? More statues. Some pops. Got a Wong. Two Wongs don't make a white. <laughs> right, whatever. I meant to say right, whatever. It's funny. Two Wongs don't make a right. That's what it is. That's the first time I've seen this Joker one. All right, that's kind of cool, but not for us. We got Nightwing, Flashpoint. See, now since, ever since somebody pointed out that there's a shiny version of the Flashpoint one, I haven't found it yet. <laughs> I haven't found it since, so then that's, we're back to where we were. And uh, that concludes this Ross toy hunt. Let's return you to your regularly scheduled program. This is how people park in Illinois. And this is why us people from Wisconsin don't trust Illinois drivers. They don't know how to park 
with clearly defined lines. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Look at this. They're just parked anywhere they want to be. This is hilarious. <laughs> All right. Okay. Back to the hunt. We're back. The hunt is over. And it was a hunt. <laughs> um, recap. Quick recap here. We got going on. That Walmart in Zion. Uh, it was all right. Not horrible. But we did find the new Flash. Uh, I, I can't really think of anything that stood out there. It was just another Walmart. Uh, the clearance was all over the place again. It was like some stuff was on clearance, some wasn't. I mean, there was enough there for me to get a pickup from there. So there was a pickup. Uh, but some. But what is going on with the NECA section? Everything was, was on clearance. Now nothing's on clearance, or just some stuff. I don't know what they're doing over there, seriously. <sighs> Anyways. Walmart was not bad. Nothing new other than the Flash. That was it. That I can think of off the top of my head. It's been a long day. <laughs> uh, we hit Dee Dee's. Not horrible. We saw the Fortnite gliders, the, the TNT Tinas. Those were cool. We saw more of the Omega Red uh, Wal Walgreens. Walgreens exclusives, so that was cool. Um, I'm out on Pops, but it's still cool to see them. Well, I can't say I'm out on Pops because I do randomly pick them up. Just a few. Anyways, both Rosses, <laughs> we found the big find. Dude, that chase, that chase uh, Sentinel was awesome. Um, the thing is huge. Um, I did forgot how big those uh, the giant pops are, but that is a, definitely a big find. Seriously, <laughs> uh, and then the other one, it's sting. We found a sting. I'm the Alan the Darby Al is it Darby Allen or Alan Darby? That one didn't look that great. I, I just I don't know something about that guy. Just nah, eh, I I don't care for him. But the sting figure looked good. The coat, it's he's got the classic sting look. You know he'll be in the pickups. Um, anyways, so we had, you know, Ross's was not bad. Dee Dee's wasn't bad. Best Buy was Best Buy. It was good. Um, I did find what I was looking for, by the way, while I was there this time. Last time I didn't. Um, but really, it was a good hunt. Uh, I didn't have anything, you know, like on my mind to find other than Bison. Because, you know, for, you know, just for me, it was just another Tuesday. If you know, you know. Um, <laughs> but anyways, you guys, I uh, hope you guys appreciate what I've been doing um, for you girl dads, uh, the lady collectors, trying to show a little bit more of the, you know, the girl collectors, the you know, the girl collectors items. Um, I don't know anything about them, but I'm trying, I'm trying, so bear with me. Eventually, I might actually know what they are. <laughs> Um, and if they are the same week after week, I'm sorry. I don't know how often they stock that stuff. I don't know what to look for yet. I'm still learning. But I uh, hope you guys like it. Um, there will be diecast on Tuesdays as usual. Uh, we'll do Legos on Thursday. Um, hopefully there's a little bit of change in inventory week to week. Um, but we'll see. We'll, we'll try it. Um, although next week it's Kane County, so that might get thrown for a loop a little bit for at least a week. Um, other than that, uh, well, let's see what else. Let's, let's make a change, to, one more change to the channel. Just one. Uh, a lot of people, I, I don't know what it is. They have this obsession with the price at Ross. After, I think it's been like eight months now, prices have been pretty established at this point. Um, you know, Legends are a certain price. G.I. Joe's a certain price. Everything is a certain price. So what I'm going to do, because sitting there and pointing out the price on everything does take a long time, I'm going to do some of you guys a favor. In the description of the video, of every video I do, I'm going to put the standard retail prices of figures that are found at Ross, whether they're G.I. Joe, G.I. Joe Deluxe, uh, whether we find Legends, oddball ones as i find them and i know the price is standard i will start putting them in there that way if i don't say the price in there they're down in the description plus gives you guys an opportunity to check out more of the page i mean come on opportunity <laughs> anyways guys i think you're done listening to me for now because we need to go to the toy table all right guys we made it to the toy table 
and uh, not to sit here and babble. Um, but anyways, about the things I said in the last snippet. They're all true. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> anyways, uh, yeah, I'm going to make that change. I'll do the Ross thing for prices. I just... I do forget that some people are new to the channel, are new to hunting, and don't always know. So, that's my bad. As much as I hate saying that, that's my bad. Uh, anyways, um, so yeah, I'll at least start doing the standard prices in the description so that they're there. Just Because there's going to be so many times where I for, forget just to say the price. So, anyways, let's uh, get to the toys. Because I want to get these opened soon, so I need to show them off real quick. So first pick up, uh, the, actually the first two are off-camera pickups. Although you guys have seen them on camera a few times, I finally bid on this. I kept going back and forth. Um, I was like, do I really need more turtles? But looking at them, they do look really good. Best action is definitely improving. Now, once I get these open, I want to check the neck, the heads and their ball joint on the neck. That's where my big main concern with them has been. The, it's it's really tight and it's hard to turn the heads. It's hard to swap them. But so far, everything else that they've been doing has been improving. So let's see if they continue that improvement with this set. Plus, I mean, it, the, art, the, the sculpt looks good. I, I'm not going to complain about that. It's a good sculpt. Uh, this next off-camera pickup was this guy. He uh, was at, I got him from Myers. You can tell by the their coupon or their tag. But I realized I never bought this one, and it was on clearance. And it was just weird. I was sitting there a day or two after I last time I filmed at Myers, I was getting groceries, and I just happened, you know, got to walk past the toilet, and he was just sitting there all by him lonesome with a tag. So I grabbed him. So that was kind of cool. Um, now I think I got almost. Well, yeah, I got I got them all in that wave now. I just never I forgot I can. Actually, I don't have pig head yet. I don't, I'm still debating if I'm going to do any Sunman figures. But yeah, so I'm almost done there. Uh, on camera pickups, got the mother of the God Emperor, Cheney. Uh, good looking figure. Uh, wired cape, wired soft goods in there. So even if I don't like the figure, the cloak is pretty good. Uh, I was talking to uh, somebody, and they said the cloak comes off pretty easily. So if it doesn't work there, I can use it somewhere else. Um, then we also grabbed this. I don't know. What is this thing? That mess, I don't know what he is, but like I said, I like the Power Ranger monsters, and it's going to go good with the rest of them. And any other monster figures I can find. Um, don't forget, it's Sting! It's Sting! But yeah, this is this is the Sting I know. This is the classic uh, Crow Sting. So having this one finally was cool. And kind of upset though, people have been finding the chase of Danhausen at Ross. I have not yet. Oop, excuse me. I have not yet found him. Um, I've seen this wave plenty of times at, oh, that's the other one. Nobody's found this one at Ross yet, but I think sh she was literally a chase. The only time you'd find the bunny in that way is wave if it was a chase. If I'm wrong, let me know down in the comments, but I'm pretty sure bunny was only a chase and limited pack. So we'll see. But anyways, uh, before we get to the greatest find of the century, for you guys, but you know, for me, it was only a Tuesday. This is actually what I went to Best Buy for. I'm going to try, got a gimbal, and I'm hoping this will, it, this won't be for store hunts, but more for like toy shows, Kane County, Mighty Con, the bigger toy shows, you know, because I notice I struggle a little bit filming the tables, um, trying to get in the crowd, and maybe having this you know, not that I want to be in people's way when they're looking at toys, but I figured this might help out, you know, letting me get in there and not just look like somebody trying to snap a couple pictures, you know. So, I don't know. We'll see. Uh, Kane County's next weekend. We're going to try it out. But anyways, the Grand Poobah. I found him. 
this thing is it just looks more amazing in person than it does in pictures look at that there that is just gorgeous oh that is amazing but anyways you guys that is the haul for this episode probably will be the last haul till kane county gotta save the pennies for that show but anyways you guys thanks for sticking around you know what you got to do like comment subscribe all that good stuff and i will definitely catch you guys on the next hunt mm -hmm.